Today we're learning more about those Arizona National Guardsmen wounded in the attack last Sunday on an outpost in Jordan. Our crew was up in Phoenix this morning to hear more from Major General Kerry Muhlenbeck. She says this has been a very humbling experience. Bringing in News 4 Tucson's Jafet Serrato now. He is live on the south, uh, south side tonight. Jafet, what are you learning from this news conference? Eric, we're learning that a female soldier had to be taken to Germany because of her injuries. Another update is that a bulk of the servicemen are now back on duty and still in the Middle East. Take a look at this map. This is where the unmanned drone attack took place. Today at the Papago Park Military Reservation, we learned that out of the 40 Arizona National Guardsmen hurt, three of them were evacuated, including a female soldier who was taken to Germany. The two other soldiers are being cared for in the Middle East region. The female soldier who was injured is now back in the United States as she continues to recover. I did have the opportunity to visit with our soldier. Quite the humbling experience, to say the least. The soldier definitely in good spirits. I expect today that she will not return back to the region. Um, she's got some recovery to do. Major General Kerry Muhlenbeck says out of the range of the injuries that those 40 National Guard servicemen uh, suffered, uh, majority of them are cuts, bruises, and blast injuries. She says most of the Arizona Guardsmen are expected to make full recoveries. Live on the South Side, Fetzerado, News 4, Tucson.